is coming out of uh, New York here. This federal jury has just reached a verdict in the so-called Goodfellas trial of the accused gangster Vincent Asaro. Uh, the man, 80 years of age, has been on trial for a string of charges, including the famed 1978 Lufthansa heist at JFK Airport that inspired the mobster movie more than a decade later. Boris Sanchez is on this for us. Boris, what's the verdict? Well, Brooke, he's been found not guilty on three charges of racketeering and two counts of extortion. Some of the things you just mentioned, the Lufthansa heist and two uh, potential counts of murder are all subparts of that extortion charge. Uh, as you mentioned, he's 80 years old. This is a case that the government has been building for many years. Uh, the defense uh, had argued that a lot of the witnesses that the prosecution put up were liars. These were ex-mobsters that uh, had allegedly worked with Asaro for uh, some time, and some of them even actually admitted to lying to the FBI previously, so obviously the jury felt that perhaps they weren't uh, the most reliable sources for information. Also, there were extensive wiretaps on Asaro for quite some time. However, there wasn't a clear indication on the wiretaps anything that explicitly linked him to these crimes. Many of them were uh, kind of uh, generic sentences that the prosecution used to allude to the fact that he may have been involved, but obviously the jury felt that uh, it wasn't enough to prove that he was guilty. Uh, we can tell you that as far as the um, his comportment in court goes, he was very uh, feisty. At one point, he kind of laughed at uh, some of the uh, testimony against him, asking, what is this Watergate? And he also had to meet with the judge and his attorney uh, because he felt that the that his attorney wasn't cross-examining some of the prosecution's witnesses strongly enough. I guess the strategy paid off for him. He's been found not guilty and he won't face any jail time.